Let's simplify this question. We'll first multiply the numerator part. So that's cubic root of r square times r square. So that's r power 4 times s power 9 over we have s square. In our next step, we'll separate the cubic root. So that's cubic root of r power 4. We'll separate it. So that's r power 3 times r times cubic root of, we'll write s power 9 as s power 3 times s power 3 times s power 3 over s square. We have cubic root of r cube times cubic root of r. We are just separating the cubic root times cubic root of s cube times cubic root of s cube times cubic root of s cube over s square. Now we have, let's cancel out cubic root and cube. So that's r times cubic root of r times s times s times s over s square. So s square and two s's on the top gets cancelled. So we are now left with r s cubic root of r. This is our final answer.